Alright guys, so, um, at last, thanks to a very, um, <laughs> um, shady decision on New York Comic Con's part to, uh, block out most of the, uh, Dragon Ball special panel, um, and by block it out, I mean block out the, um, actual important announcement footage, I still can finally confirm for you guys that, um, that the, uh, long-awaited web or streaming anime rumored by the um, Dragon Ball community for about a year now doesn't is in fact coming next year fall of 2024 and and yes guys the rumors are true it um at the start of this in episode one um Goku is going to in fact be turned back into a child, but, but the catch is, and what makes the, um, newly named Dragon Ball Di Daima different from Dragon Ball GT is, it's not just Goku and Supreme Kai that gets turned back into children, everybody gets the, um, child treatment in Dragon Ball Daima, um, and so, yes, everybody, um, it, it said that because of a conspiracy, um, these, um, two new, um, demons, possibly from, from a new version of Hell or the Demon Realm, have been spying on Goku and the rest of the Z Fighters, um, focusing strangely, it seems, on the Margin Blue Saga. At, and because of a weird conspiracy, um, Goku and the gang all get turned back into children, um, and, uh, Goku and Supreme Kai have to travel to different realms to confront these demons, and, uh, and, uh, and undo Shenron's wish to get everybody back into their adult forms, and, um, and, and and Akira did confirm that he is more involved in this that 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 than he was with the Dragon Ball Super. In fact, guys, production on this um began all the way back in late twenty twenty one. And and um Dragon Ball Dima now as it's you know, known what was that generally decided on and trademarked on October 6th, literally days ago, guys, this, uh, final title was decided on, and, um, the, uh, and, uh, and the animation for this, guys, truly does look spectacular, um, now, I personally don't have a problem with, uh, Dragon Ball Dima turning everybody Back in the kids again since everybody's getting reduction. Even, um, her kill Mr. Satan, still whatever you want to say. Her kill and Matt Roshi as well don't even get spared, spared from turning back in the kids. And yes, it does make, um, Goten and Trunks turn back in the babies, even though we just. Finally got to see them aged up in Dragon Ball Super Superhero. And, and yet, guys, some of, some, mem some members of the community are calling this, um, Dragon Ball's version of Tiny Toons and, 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 and I've already declared it as kind of a hot take. Um, but, but, but like everything, um, let, let's just give a, Dragon Ball Dima a chance and be, um, and keep our expectations low and tempered because Akira did also state in his message that Goku will be using the, uh, Power Pole for the first time in a while because Dragon Ball Dima is, um, basically going to strip Goku, Vegeta, and the gang of all their powers, 
So most of the fights within Dragon Ball Time uh, are going to be just like um, the old school um, way that Goku and everybody used to handle fights with just basic martial art techniques. Again, everybody, Dragon Ball Time uh, will be coming out in fall of next year. And more information about Dragon Ball Time uh, will be released um, in Dra in January at the um, Dragon Ball Battle Hour. Again, guys, one week we can expect more information about Dragon Ball Dima in January of 2024 at Dragon Ball Battle Hour. And and since the uh, fake voice of Boma, Monica Real, um, Monterey in the panel, and the uh, voice of Whis as well, and St. Clair were there. Hopefully, guys, this means that, um, that, that, that the dub will come quick. And, uh, at, and the only other bad thing about the dub is, it, it that also means that Colleen will have to return as the, uh, voice of Kid Goku. Have a good one.